Hey Studio, this is a short video of how to export as images from Illustrator and then put them into your Wix website. So I have my Illustrator artboards when I created these different text effects. And once, um, if I need them to be images in Illustrator, remember I have to export instead of save as. So I'm gonna go up to file, down to export, and over to export as. Again, that's file, export, export as. And then for this particular project, I'm gonna go ahead and click use artboards because I have five different artboards for my different text effects. And I'm going to say text effects with Illustrator. And I'm gonna then make sure I know it as a PNG file, it's gonna go to my desktop and then I'll click export. Now screen is just fine. Now notice how we know the reason why this saves with a with an um, a transparent image because it is a PNG file. You could go back to File, Export, Export As, and then also choose JPEG if you wish. Use Artboards, same gig. Name it Text Effects Illustrator. Make sure you know where it's going, and then click Export. Um, it is fine to use CMYK. Because we're on the web, we want to use either medium or low. Um, screen is just fine, so I'll click OK. And then I have all five of these now saved inside my desktop as different images. So from here, I'm going to go ahead and open up my Wix website. And then I will, let me log in with my school account here, my other account. So sign in with your school credentials. And then I will go ahead and go to edit site. Once I'm navigating from my dashboard, again, I will choose to go to site actions, edit site. And then from here, I'm gonna wait for it to cook. It may take a little while, um, but long story short, you're going to go to create a new blog post or manage blog post. thinking hopefully it's going to be there activating soon and ba bam I'm gonna wait for all my different options to pop up and I go down navigate down to the left hand side to the my blog section and I will go ahead and go to create a new post and the post I would like to create is called text effects in Illustrator And from here, I will just go to my, and because I have five of them, I will go ahead and click on Add a Gallery. And so once I click on Add a Gallery, it will say, all right, what do you want to put inside this gallery? I need to go to communicate with, with Wix what I would like to put inside. So I'm going to go ahead and upload media, then upload from my computer. And reminder, we saved all of these inside um, in the desktop, in the desktop. And we saved them as text effects illustrator so when i scroll down to that part notice how one two three four five awesome i'm going to click the first one hold down shift and then click the last one and then click open this should um, download all of them inside and i don't love the order so i'm going to reorder this so I'm going to click here and click here, select all five. I did a shift click, shift click for the front and the back, add to page, and I have my gallery. Now I'm gonna go ahead and choose collage. I don't love that either. Maybe I'll try this thumbnails. That doesn't look good either. And um, I will put most likely, there we go. Go ahead and then reminder in Wix, you have to publish to your website. So I published my website, but wait, I'm not done. You have to publish to the world in order for me to see it. So I've published my blog to the website, then I close this window out. Then I have to publish the website to the world. So once I click on this publish link, and then I will go ahead and check what it looks like by clicking view site. Then I'll navigate to the blog section of my website. And lo and behold, here are my text effects that I created 
inside Illustrator. So that was how to export from Illustrator and then insert into your Wix website. Take care.